Hey, look, Mom, I cleaned my room. Not really. I just put up a green screen. So anyway, this video is about the 2020 Chevy Bolt and the uh, fact that they've done away with the Hilltop Reserve. They've gone to a uh, very granular charging control. This is what I use. I'm going to explain that in the video and kind of explain my uh, strategy. So thanks for watching. Give me a subscribe at the end. We just hit 100 subscribers and I really appreciate you guys doing that. So take a look. We'll talk again after the video. This is the charging screen on the 2020 Chevy Bolt. They've done away with Hilltop Reserve. What they've done is they've allowed you to go as low as 40%. Uh, that's eight of the little tiny bars. Each larger bar that you see there is 25%. So from that bar out is 25%. So each gray box and each black box is 5%. So the way I do it for strategy, like if I know I'm gonna go to work and I'm gonna be gone a few days, I would take that and run this up by 44 miles. See, like it's showing I've got a range of 119, so I would add 44 miles to that. And there you go, 163 miles, because I believe 40% is the optimal like storage capacity for these batteries. Your battery's gonna get the longest life if it's stored sitting at 40%. So that's how I do it. And then I've got plenty of range to get back. You know, I'm still, I'm still down to 40%, which at this point is showing me 120 miles. There's gonna be more cool videos to follow, podcasts, etc. Thank you again. So there's going to be a lot of debate over this, I think. Uh, I know when I had the Nissan Leaf, they had a problem with the battery degrading very quickly because they did not account for the heat. Uh, cars that were in hot areas like Phoenix were losing battery capacity very quickly. So there's going to be debate about that over whether this uh, is actually necessary. Uh, me, personally, I'm probably just going to be on the conservative side for unknown factors. I know this is a kind of a new chemistry, I believe. I know they just changed the battery. So this is the first generation of that battery. So I'm gonna be conservative. A lot of people say it's not gonna matter and they haven't lost capacity or whatever. I hope that's true. I'm gonna kinda of see how it goes, take some readings, and uh, we can debate this in the comments. So feel free. I kinda of say you could be right. I could be conserving my battery for no reason. Or other people say, yeah, you know, if you don't need the charging capacity, there is gonna be some degradation at the higher charge states during storage. So. What do you think? Let me know. Charging technique note on the, say that 10 times fast, technique note. Technique note. Anyway. Uh...